What is up ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. I'm showing you the video you've all been waiting for, how to jailbreak iOS 7.1.x using Pongu on your Mac. Yes, the Mac version of Pongu is now out. As you can see here, if you go to iDownload Blog, go to Downloads, go ahead and download the Mac version of Pongu right now. It is out there, available, and ready to download. So that's what I'm doing right now. That's the first step that you need to take if you want to jailbreak your iOS 7.1.x device. That can include, of course, iOS 7.1, iOS 7.1.1. If you want to jailbreak on your Mac, you can do that right now in English, by the way. So here it is. Here's the download pongu.app. You just want to double click on the pongu.app icon there. And once you do that, you'll get a little dialogue asking if you want to open. We'll do that right now. And there's the dialog. So click open. And now here is the Pongu jailbreak tool. You can see it detects my device, which is already plugged in. Make sure your device is plugged in. Uh, I'm running iOS 7.1.1 on my iPod touch here. So now, yes, I can just click jailbreak and the jailbreak will begin. And once you click jailbreak, you're going to get this little message here asking you to do something. It asks you to go to your settings app. So you just want to tap on your settings app, go to the general section, and then click on or tap on the date and time section here. So that's what we're going to do. And we're going to set the time to June 2nd and that will kick off the jailbreak. So just go to settings. If you're already in general, you want to go to the date and time section, which is right here, turn off set automatically, and then set your date and time or set your date, I should say to June 2nd. That's all you need to do. And once you do that, you don't need to touch anything. It'll just automatically know that the date's set right and it'll kick off that jailbreak here. You can see it's injecting bundles right now. Please wait and eventually you'll see the Pongu app icon on your home screen and it actually tells you to tap on that app icon. So just do that, tap on continue and you'll see the Pongu app load up and the jailbreak will continue to process. So just keep the device connected, keep it on that screen, let it reboot, it'll reboot and don't disconnect your device during any of this and just be patient. Now you want to go ahead and unlock your device. Make sure your device isn't passcode protected, by the way. I should have mentioned that at the outset, but just make sure your device isn't passcode protected to prevent any issues. And then once you unlock your device there, it'll reboot again and then the jailbreak will be finished and you will see Cydia on your home screen, ready to, to launch, ready to configure all the cool jailbreak apps and tweaks there. So here we are at our lock screen, going to unlock, swipe over, and guess what? Yes, there it is. Cydia, ladies and gentlemen. So that is how you jailbreak on your Mac using Pongu for iOS 7.1.x. Let me know what you think in the comments. This is Jeff with iDownload Blog.